Are these guys gonna be here? Or are they gonna be asleep? Oh, they're all stunned. Look at that. I could take them all if I wanted. Hmm. Oh yeah, there are some pretty good ones here. Um, are you going to edit our arguing? Yes. I figured Don't you would. Don't talk about it. That's more editing. Well, I know, but then then people can be like, "Ooh, mysterious," but they'll never know. Shut up. Don't tell me that to shut so up. That is so gay. No, it isn't. Yeah, it is. No, it isn't. Yeah, it is. It's cool. It's gay. You might think it's gay, but I disagree. What can I say? It's gay. What can I say? It's so gay of you to say that, Andrew. It's so gay. Don't say hooray. Are you gonna, are you gonna put a little bit in though? I'll... Andrew, shut up! I'll do what I want! I've told you. Just don't talk about the recording. Just don't. Well, sometimes it's okay, but sometimes, sometimes it isn't. Sometimes it's okay, but don't talk about the editing. That's what I'm saying. Don't talk about the editing. If you want to suggest stuff, suggest stuff afterwards, but not during recording. Because I'll have to edit that out. No, it's, just, it's, what, it's, it's what's on my mind right now. Well, write it down! Well, we got to talk. Like, I can't talk about stuff that I'm not thinking about. Write it down! No, I mean, for recording. Why? We, we need to what? talk for the recording, and this was Why just you... what was on my brain at the time. Well, think of something else. Think of Ice Age. Why don't you ever try fajitas? When's the last time you saw, saw Ice Age? Uh, I don't know, but it's the best one of all of them. Yes. It actually has a good thematic resonance, whereas the others are just typical family films. And which hell. Isn't, which isn't bad. It's like Madagascar. Family film, funny, silly, but I think the first Ice Age, because it was kind of like an unconventional family dynamic, wasn't it? About being crap, yeah. Apparently I'd completed a sub-objective of not being grabbed by a puppet. Yeah, yeah. Didn't know that was a thing. Anyhow, I got an S. Mm-hmm. I guess that must be pretty easy to get an S. I can't believe how much how bad I was in. I don't think that suit defends me very well. I Neither took barely I. any damage. That's why I think you know, that whole thing is a piece of shit. Because the amount the amount of time you don't get hurt while you're in a sneaking suit is almost just as good as having extra health, isn't it? And it makes you regenerate quicker. It makes you a bigger target and you just take more damage, I think. Yeah. I'm not gonna waste diamonds on that next upgrade. Maybe it does increase exponentially but I've never needed it and I think it looks stupid where the hell did Ocelot come from uh, he was in the helicopter when he oh the one that just yeah, came yeah. in he wasn't in the one that crashed that crashed no it wasn't that one oh I think Ocelot's in love oh wow right in his eyeball <laughs> and Snake just like, no, 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 any closer, it's going to my eye. Oh, thank God for that. Hmm. I like how Kaz is just listening and he's pretending to be part of the conversation. But really, he's not. Don't you think some of the stuff that's happening in this game is way worse than what happens in Metal Gear Solid 4? Sure, Ocelot could control everything. With SOP, mm -hmm. but they're releasing epidemics, making super soldiers that are pretty much unstoppable. Yeah, whereas MGS4 was nano machines controlled. This yeah. is all like biological warfare, isn't it? I mean, what do they have? I mean, I've noticed how in this game they don't have four main bad guys. Mm. They just have the skulls. Pretty they're, much. Yeah. And skull face. He's yeah. like a symbol of everything. So um, it's almost like you're the bad guy unit in this, except you're the good guys. Almost. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think it's scarier because with technology, you've got the sense that it's being controlled, it's electronic, it's artificial. Whereas you get the sense that if you meddle with nature, it can spiral out of control in ways you don't predict. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ugh, my ear is itchy. That's the weirdest thing when you wear headphones for so long, it just makes your ears itch. Mm. I hope that's not, you know, cancer or something like that. You know, it must be so weird having somebody um, who's blind as a friend. Because 
the way I see it, from looking at this guy, there's two kinds of blind people. <laughs> there's blind people who, you know, they don't use their eyes at all. Like, they just, like, they just, you know, they just stand there. And obviously they're not looking at you because, you know, they can't see. Mm. But they just don't, there's no movement in their eyes whatsoever. And then there's the other kind, where they, they are using their eyes. They're actively just looking around. And I don't know if that's because people who are born with blindness, they, they don't need to move around yeah, their yeah, eyes because yeah. they've, they've never known the need to. Mm. But people who become blind after a, after a period of time, you know... They sort of get used to using it, yeah, their eyes. Yeah, it's a reflex. You know, you're going to be moving around your eyes regardless if you can see out of them. For expressiveness. Actually, yeah. he can see out of his eyes. Kind of. Oh, that seems pretty cool. So if you collect skull stuff, you can use it. You can only get an A rank on a mission if you use it, but it apparently does have some cool powers. Have you got it? Uh, yeah, I've never used it though. Mm. So we can extract skulls now. Yes. And it only took us needing them to make armor for us to do it. Well, I mean, I would have done it anyway. It was getting Code Talker. Who, um, cause he's, a, he's a scientist. He got, studies the parasites. We got a Portuguese guy. Cool. We got one of everyone now. Really? No. Well, I don't know. Like, how would you know that? I was joking. I know that now. I was making it seem like getting soldiers of different race was almost like uh, finishing a collection. When you, well, should, when you shouldn't really view things that way. Quite what, a few what, if cars, what if Cars just like said, we don't need the likes of him. He's like, Cars, <laughs> just cut that shit out, right? You, he works for Cypher. I know you think we're alright how we are, but come on. Everybody's got diseases. you got to let some people in. This guy can help. <laughs> Here's your quarantine deck. Alright. I thought it was just going to be filled to the brim with people. Yeah, it's almost like the game doesn't seem to think you'll have as many people by this point in the story as you do. Yeah. Oh god. Cause look at Ocelot not wearing like a face mask or anything. Mm. He didn't give a shit. Just because he can't get t taken down by a tranquilizer it doesn't mean he can't get diseases. Yeah. He got fox died, didn't well, I don't, he? I don't think it's airborne. It's only affecting people who have Kikongo. Oh god. Oh no, we're actually killing people. No, not killing them, burning the, their corpses. Oh, so the ones that died. Yeah. Burning. Okay. And That's he's, all right. he's giving them a special parasite that mutates them so that they all become female. So they still have it, but they can't reproduce. Whoa. <laughs> what if they don't agree to it? I don't want to be a lady. I want to be a man. Oh, um. It doesn't okay. turn them into ladies, but it does make them sterile. Oh, okay. Mm. So just like little eggs come out of a dick instead of, instead of like the stream of semen. <laughs> I don't know if it's quite that. So just women? No. No, no. It's turning all of the parasites into females, so they can't oh, reproduce. Oh. Okay. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. A side effect is that it makes the soldiers sterile. Okay. But to them, it's more important they can talk than it they can have kids. To who? Them. Who's them? The soldiers. What? It's more important to be able to talk to them than it is to have kids. Yeah, yeah, that, that's understandable, yeah. But when you said to them, when I said to who, and then you said to them, can I just say well done? Well done? Because obviously well, who else I didn't know. would I be know. talking about? Well, I didn't know because I asked you. Who else? And then you... Don't say who else. You could have been talking about the parasites again. Oh, okay. Parasites can't have kids. Right. Why would that affect them? They're parasites. They don't have that kind of... They don't yearn for a family life. Is Cars blind? Uh, I don't know. He looks blind. He's got like that, that white that white thing going on. Then again. <gasps> so do the skulls. Mm. So do the people infected. I wonder if he's infected. Who's this now? My theory is that 
he doesn't have he is he's not got very good eyesight after being beaten up and everything but then Kotalker gave him some parasites to help him a bit yeah mm. oh shit so he's actually got cybernetic uh, implants oh, no. or just implants yeah those are just implants to he, he attaches them to the base of his spine and to the inside of his bone so that they can are they going to inject him with acid no 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 he's threatening to pour acid on the bits that are attached to his bone because it will be very very painful alright <laughs> oh god I think he knows because his legs are very important to him aren't they so that's like his his pressure point yeah You know, I really like Huey's design. Yeah, he does look. He's exactly how you'd expect, like a ner like a scientist nerd like him. Yeah, an eccentric. Being. He's like really, he's perspiring a lot. Mm, and also, he's got those sort of hippie glasses, doesn't he? Yeah. That he thinks look pretty cool. I don't want to say I don't want to sound like a cur or nothing, but I think the sweatier, the bettier. Mhm. Mm it just looks cool. It just it adds tone to their face. Texture, even. Mm hmm. It's, uh, I'm saying all this, but you can't see any of it because they've decided to look at his. Skull face is the world's arguably cool hairstyle as well. He's got weird wrinkles on his nose, isn't he? Yeah. Well, that's the thing. I think he has the, mo the best animated face. Yeah. Because he's got, like, when he was getting injected, he's like, ah, and you can see, like, the laugh, well, not laughter lines, but, you know. He's just got the most expressive face. And I think they've kind of smoothed out, like, Quiet's face especially has been really smoothed over. Yeah. Do you think he um has pain receptors in his legs? Uh, no. If this happens, it's <coughs> going to be very painful. I don't like how Ocelot's smiling through this. He's starting to seem like a bad guy again. Yeah. I think he's just trying to be as threatening as possible. Oh shit! Oh, KB Zero, this philanthropist is beyond the Soviet base camp. In a Are you serious? Soviet philosophers. Yep. That's what you're looking for. He knows. He knows. Why didn't he tell us? Uh, he has his reasons. Whoa. About time, us. Uh, no, don't do anything, please. Don't do it. <laughs> I think he's just making sure. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I suppose that's all right then. Hmm. Well, yeah, I don't think he intended to use it. He just wanted to make it look like he really would. I don't know. I think he might. Have. Uh, yeah, I think Isolot might have done it. I just think he knew that he wouldn't have needed to because Huey's legs are so important to him that he would have done anything to protect them. Oh, now what are you doing? Oh yeah, this was pretty shit. No, no. What's he doing? Oh! Wait! What's he gonna do to stop that? What? Did he, why did he do that? Was that an empty syringe? I think he was just doing that to threaten him. What do you think it was an empty one? He was just he was just putting it in his leg. Um, no, I think he just did it because he was he doesn't like him. He wanted him to be a little scared because you know he's been lying to him. All right, you still haven't answered my question. What do you oh. did you think it was an empty syringe? Oh no, I think he was just putting it down. I don't think it was an empty syringe. I answered your question. Right. You didn't though. You, you I said, did. You did I said, you did. I said, no, 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 no. I said, oh no. no. I said, okay. oh no. All right, right. Let me tell you this, all yeah. right? Whenever I ask you a yes or no question, yeah. you never, ever give me a yes or a no. You always give me something to add to it. Why you, does there's that, no why need does that to add to the equation. There's no need. Well, obviously, I think there is, because no, that's there why isn't. I answer. No, I'm telling you, there isn't. Because I don't require anything else. I just require a one-word answer. Well, that's great for having conversations, isn't it? Yes, it's no not a answers. Conversation. It was that. Why do they keep saying to be continued? Because now it's getting towards the end, so it's trying to give it some tension. What do you mean towards the end? 
getting towards the end. You've only got a few missions left before the end of part one. Oh, In shit. fact, I think you've only got three more. Well, as so long as they're free. Oh, no, no. Actually, you might press start. Oh, wow. The first infection. Oh, yep. Yeah, you've only got uh, two, one or two left. No, no, two or three. Right, okay. Oh, wait. <gasps> are they all okay now? Who? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. My oh, staff. Your staff are better. Yes! Hallelujah! Yes! Hallelujah! But Hallelujah! Died anyway. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Oh, are some of them. Oh, none of them are in quarantine. Quarantine doesn't even exist. Okay. What? What do you mean, okay? Oh, no, quarantine still exists. What do you mean, okay? I asked you then. Yeah, what do you mean, what do you mean, okay? Because you just said, okay. You didn't, instead of saying yes, you went, okay. Well. And that obviously is implying, all right, that's what you think, Dan. That's what you think. No, no. You're going to feel really stupid in a minute. No, quarantine is, the strut is still there, but. We know. don't need it anymore. Not really, no. Andrew? There's, what? Not really? I don't think. Not really? I don't think so, no. There's one side mission that involves it, but that's about it. And you, you're there for like 10 seconds before it's unimportant again. Fuck it. We're ending the episode. Okay. Goodbye. In I fact, hope you've enjoyed me losing my voice. And good mental health. Turn this shit off. Yes, sir.